Hello and welcome to my video tutorial. I'm going to show you how to record actions in Photoshop. Basically what an action is, is a process you go through in Photoshop, something like flipping the canvas. So if you went to image, rotate canvas, flip horizontally, you know, you'd have to do all that. And if you're working all the time like me, then that ends up sucking up a lot of your time and you, you know, you'll end up going through that process a million times. So what you're going to want to do is uh, just go to Window, Actions, make sure Actions is clicked, Actions box opens up. You want to click the uh, little square here with the corner flipped up. So you click that, it says make a new action. So type in what it is, flip canvas, set a function key. It gives you all the F2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And uh, well, after this, I'm also going to show you how to apply this to your tablet. So click F5 and press record. Once you press record, you're going to want to do the action. So go to image, rotate canvas, flip horizontally. After you do that, go back to your actions window. Don't do anything else. And it'll show that it's recording with the little red button. It doesn't matter how long it records because it just records the actions you do. So just press stop and there's a black square and it's saved. So let's try it out. Now I'll just press F5 and it flips. So secondly we're going to want to go to our tablet. So let's scroll down to my tablet. Click on your Wacom tablet. Click on the properties and here you have a bunch of selections you're going to want to click functions next to tool and i have an intuos 4 it also works with intuos 3 the functions keys so i have mine all set up and uh i have a flip canvas on mine it's the top button so basically what you do is you select the button you want to do and you go to keystroke once you go to keystroke you go and you just uh, type in F3. So like I could type in F5 as well. And as you can see, it just puts it in there. <clears throat> so I can just go back, clear it. And I can make it F5 now. Okay, that's my flip canvas. And I can name it flip canvas. And that's it. So now I'll go take up my tablet, press the flip canvas button, and it flips. You can also do this with many things. You can do it with uh, pretty much anything. Saving files, you can do it with Control Z. You can go to Windows Actions and hit the record button and just press Control Z on your keyboard. And you just make a shortcut for it on your tablet. So every time you want to press Control Z, you just hit that and it does it for you. So I hope that helps. And uh, for more information on other things I got going on, you can go to DaveRaposa.com. And if you're interested in daily studies, you can always check out my uh, study group, which goes on every morning at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, which is also 2 GMT. And uh, you can figure out what time that is for you. But uh, that goes on every day. And we meet on live stream. And you can get there by going to CrimsonDaggers.com and clicking the banner below. It's also banners to the sketchbook. So... Hope you learned something. Hope it's useful. And thanks for watching.